This is the easiest cow farm for Minecraft Bedrock, and as always, there will be a world download in the description. Alright, the first thing we're going to do is grab our hoppers and mine out two blocks in the floor and place down two hoppers running into these blocks. Go ahead and get rid of those blocks and place down a double chest right here, which is going to collect all of the steak and the leather. We're then going to go ahead and grab our blocks and create three blocks right here, three blocks right here. We're going to set down two slabs above that chest so we can open it. And then we're going to place down blocks on the back side of those hoppers. We're then going to grab our signs now and place... Okay, three S's. And place a sign here as well. Then we're going to grab our blocks again and create another layer, leaving this one block open right here along with the front. We're going to go ahead and place down a dispenser right here. And we can grab our glass now and we can place down one, two, three, and four pieces of glass. Go ahead and grab your blocks again. We're going to build up this time by three and then we're going to finish this off with one more layer of blocks bringing the total of the front side to four blocks tall and on the back side of the farm we're going to place down a two by two of blocks bringing this platform to a two by three square and then we're going to surround it in blocks to fully encase it so none of the cows can escape we're then going to place down a strip of blocks right here this is going to be where our adult cows go. This is going to be where the babies fall. So we're going to grab our signs now and place down a sign right here. And we're going to place down a sign right here. And we are also going to place down some temporary blocks right here. We can then grab our water buckets and place down two water buckets at the back here. And we will remove those temporary blocks once we have enough adult cows in this top chamber. For now though, you know what, actually, we're going to leave this because it's going to be a really easy way to break your temporary blocks. On the side of the farm, we're going to grab our blocks and we're going to create a staircase of blocks going all the way up to that top. So that way we can get two adult cows inside of this area. So I'm just going to go ahead and spawn two in. Imagine you lured these guys and you're just bringing them over to your farm. So we're going to bring them up now. <coughs> And then we're going to push them into the water. So let's just get rid of the sheep, bring this cow up here, and then push him into the water as well. Just like that. And now that we have both of them in there, we can go ahead and place down a fence post and then two fence posts over top of here and two as well. So that way they are nice and contained. And now what we were going to do now that we have two of them is we are just going to breed them and we're going to keep breeding them until we have about 50 cows or so. The more cows you have, the faster the farm is going to be, but also the more lag it's going to generate. So depending on your platform, you're going to want to vary the amount of cows you put up here. All right. And once you have about 50 cows up here, we're ready to go ahead and break these temporary blocks. Before we do that, though, I just want to show you something real quick. We're going to need to put lava inside of this dispenser so that way we can cook the cows or if you want to trade the raw beef with a villager, then you can use a looting three sword down here and you'll get the raw beef along with the leather. But with the lava bucket here, we can go ahead and place a wooden button. And if we go ahead and drop a cow in here to pretend like there is an adult cow, so he's all grown up. When we go ahead and press the button, when we go ahead and press the button, it is going to retract and then we press it again once it pops back out. That is perfectly timed so that all of the cows that are adults in the chamber are going to end up getting cooked and the steak and the leather are going to end up inside of this large chest. So now that that is done, we are going to go ahead and remove these two blocks right here in line with the signs. So one and two the baby cows are going to pop out. Go ahead and block this up now because there's no reason for that to be open. And now what we can do is we can just go ahead and breed these cows. And every time we breed, we're just going to get more cows at the bottom. The awesome thing about this farm is that because it only takes one to two minutes to breed the cows, uh, we can actually breed them quite a lot before we actually have all of the baby cows down here. And once they start growing up, we're going to have even more. If you see baby cows up there, they will eventually fall before they turn into adults. So not to worry at all. And uh, yeah, it's that simple. We're just going to keep breeding the cows and then they're going to end up in the chamber. We're going to kill them and we get all of the XP for breeding them. And we will also get the XP if you end up going down the looting three villager route. But I personally prefer to have my steak cooked. All right, that is going to do it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, then be sure to subscribe and leave a like. My name is 1UpMC and I'll catch you guys in the next one.